What does money mean to those of you? To some, it may mean spending on luxuries, receiving more money and spending again. Some see money as a cause for having to work harder in order to stay on top of debts. However, amongst us here in this room are many individuals who desire financial success, but believe they will never achieve their goal. Many of you may not, but this is only because you don't remember that, yes, money generates from hard work, and of course you can use it to make lives more interesting and easier. But there is also a majority of you in this room who desire financial success like those of Richard Branson or Bill Gates. But to you, I advise you that that sort of success in money derives from a brilliant idea and serious hard work. In 2008 to 2009, the UK sank into a recession. This is a period of time from which a country falls into economic decline. The, re the recovery of which has been sluggish. This has had an immense effect on the citizens of the UK due to the fact that many of young people are unemployed and are having to claim benefits in order to live. This is less than the minimum wage. And this is even harder when you consider that just the loaf of bread in any British shop or supermarket has increased by an astonishing 15%. And the cost of trying to heat your own homes even has increased. Jennifer Callar Anderson from the TMF board carried out an experiment in her ho own home to see how much heating bills have increased. She carried out the experiment and she stated, I had my heating on for three months. On December the 20 2011, I got my bill. It was an astonishing £431.83. This is terrible, especially when you consider last year. It was just a shy £300 with an insane lodger that used the heating at 15 degrees, six hours a day for six months. So, serious hard work and serious brilliant ideas may not achieve financial success like Richard Branson or Bill Gates, for instance, but it can in increase the probability of getting a job, which will make your lives more interesting and easier. Thank you.